Yellow duckies and welcome to Paleo Pines. This is a life sim, farming sim style game where you're on an island with friendly dinosaurs. I can't wait. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. So, as per usual, my name's Viola. If you like what you see, hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And let's go! Sorry, I'm super excited. Welcome to Paleo Pines, a peaceful island full of dinosaurs. Let's create your character, buy new clothes later, so relax, pick something you like. Okay. Um, names. Let's go with the pale green. Clothes. Don't. I think they really have get up purple eyes, but no. <laughs> and hair, blue hair. Nice. Let's look at the styles available. Let's go back to the first page. Hmm. Is that side ponytail or yeah, that side Wow, it auto filled my. <laughs> uh, let's just let's just shorten this down to just Viola. Too big to fit in the house, little buddy. We're here, Paleo Pines. Oh, lucky, it's exactly how I imagined it. Well, maybe not exactly. I mean, it's a little rundown, but you're right, we'll definitely make it work. Phew, 
Today was long, but we made it. Well done, Lucky. Hmm. Here, let me grab you a treat. You must be hungry. Carol, that was the last one. Well, I didn't eat them all. <laughs> what have you found, Lucky? Oh, it looks cozy. Just like your old sleeping patch. Look, there's even a dreamstone. Can't sleep patch. It's time for me to go find my own. Good night, Lucky. Okay, so I gotta figure out how to get up into my house, considering. Uh oh, something's fallen in front of the ladder. Maybe Lucky can help. Sorry, Lucky. I know you're tired, but I need your help so I can sleep too. It'll be quick, I promise. Told you it would be quick. You're right. Rest now. Explore tomorrow. Okay. Good night, Lucky. For real this time. Now about breakfast. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, oh. <laughs> that went by quick. See you on. Sometimes you just gotta follow the tracks and see where they take you. Oh, my gums and tongues. Mary, are you seeing this? I see it, but I swear my blinkers are messing with me. Is that... Is that a real... Parasaro... Lofus... Sorry, guys, I don't know what from... Her name is Lucky. What a beauty she is! See, I told you it was worth the rush. When I first saw the tracks, I was so tempted to race after them, but... No, I said to myself, Mary, you can't chase these without Owen, even if it takes him an hour to gather up all his things. It wasn't an hour. No, you're right. More like two. Preparedness is important. Anyway, it's a pleasure to meet you and your Parasaur lo Lophus. Blah, 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 blah. Parasaur. Yes. You know, we haven't seen one since... Actually, we've never seen one. Never? Uh-oh. I thought you didn't come to Paleo Pines looking for her... I hope you didn't come to Paleo Pines looking for herds of Parasaur galloping through the hills. Now, now, hold on. They're definitely around, right? At least we think they are. Mary, you've seen tracks. Well, sure, but that's all I've ever seen. They show up from time to time, so they must be around you somewhere. Imagine, a real Parasaur living right here in Viridian Valley. Wait, you are planning on moving in, aren't you? thousand times, yes. Yeehaw, new neighbors. Oh, and you bring anything with you that could stand in for an impromptu housewarming gift? Oh, hmm, well, I only have time to pack for what I thought was spur-of-the-moment field study. So, like, three of everything and enough clothes for a month? I happen to have just the thing. Really, Owen? One of your journals? Yes, just so happens I brought two blank ones in case we discovered something remarkable, and we did. Trust me, 
If you're starting ranch, there's a lot you'll need to remember. Write it all down and you'll never forget. Actually, that makes sense. Here, I've got something for you too. Pocket full of herbivore food? Yeah, it's all I brought. Besides, that's a hungry looking parasaur. And you can't exactly eat a journal. You'd be surprised. That's some of the best herbivore food that shells can buy, courtesy of Corlin's Randoms and Abundance. If you're looking for more of that or anything else, Pebble Plaza should be your next destination. It's not far, and it's got everything. Hey, make sure you meet Marlo. He'll get you anything you need to fix up this pen and the rest of your ranch. Fun? Rude. What? Look at it. It's a mess. We'd better go. Sorry about all that. What? What did I say? Hope to see you around sometime. And good luck with moving in. Yes, good luck. And trust me, that journal will be your best, your new best friend. Er, second best friend. Bye now. Wedding day? Oh my gosh. Picnic. Shenanigans? Okay. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on. I'm coming. I'm coming. There we go. Let's go riding for now. We gotta go to town anyway. Apparently. Oh. Loading screen, loading screen. Meridian Valley discovered. House. Pretty place. That's by equipping your journal. No. Okay, running wears down my stamina in this game. Don't just stand there golfing. Come over and say hello. Ah, are you the wee be beaky who just moved into that old ranch? Welcome to Paleo Pines. Finally, that place needs a good weeding like a Wurisaurus needs watermelons. My name's Agami, but everyone around here just calls me Granny. 
You must be looking for Pebble Plaza. Come on, let old Granny introduce you to the neighborhood. Right this way, after me. Welcome to Pebble Plaza. If we don't got it, you don't need it. Actually, it's more like if we don't got it, you're out of luck. <laughs> At least until the path to Dapplewood is open again. But that's a problem for another day. We've got enough and that's enough. Pebble Plaza is a place for gathering and trade. If you've got crops, seeds, bits of wood and stone, someone here will trade for it. Plus you can trade anything for shells here. We use these for sort of a common currency. Go on, here's a few for me. In case you need and you see something you like. You want to spend it all in one place? <laughs> Here, let me give you a quick tour. That's my stall over there. I've got seeds to grow. Just about anything from pumpkins to pineapple. Well, usually anyway. These days it's more like potatoes to potatoes. Slim pickings these days, I'm afraid. Did I mention the path the Dapplewood is blocked? I'm sure I did. Top of the hill, you'll usually find Pippin. Not today though, it's baking day. Pippin makes poppins. Pippin's real sweet, and poppins are, well, I'll let you decide for yourself. Tell you what, you come back tomorrow and meet them, they'll sort you out with a tasty snack. Well, er, a snack. Right, see the lad behind me? That's Corlin. If you're after anything, Corlin's the best place to start. You've got everything from flowers to fibers, bib dibbers. He's not much of a chat box, but He's well stocked and cheerful enough. And over to my right is Marlo. Marlo, come and say hello. Marlo, Viola just moved into the old ranch in the valley. I've heard, lovely spot. Pleasure to meet you. Marlo is our woodsman. Takes care of the trees around here. Not only that, Give the man a stick or a log, and he can build pretty much anything with it. Pride of the Pines, we call him. Nobody calls me that, but I'll admit I'm pretty good with my hands. If there's something you need, I'll do what I can. And there's only so much I can do without my proper workshop tools. Speed Witch, any word on the path of Dapplewood's granny? I haven't checked myself, but I reckon we'd hear about it if anything changed. Well, anyway, lovely to meet you, Viola. Hey, since you're fixing up that old ranch, I reckon these should come in handy. Happy housewarming to you. From strong roots comes ripe fruits. Well, Marlo, just when I think you couldn't be any nicer, you're going out to do yourself. Enjoy the rest of your day. Told you Marlo was a decent chap. Those will come in handy, I'm sure. As soon as I've got time, I'll swing by your ranch and show you how to use them. But for now, I'd best be hopping along. Stop by my stall. I might have something for you. This is adorable. Hello. Just getting started. Okay. There were a notebook to Avery for me. I borrowed it last week. Garlic. Last notebook. I have some mud. Here's me here. Let me give you something to welcome you to Viridian Valley. Just some carrot seeds. Not much, but better than a tooth in the tail. Can't wait for someone to reopen my way home, though. My garden must be in terrible state. See anything else that interests you? I should really sit down. Don't be a stranger. Mm. Hey, alright, I'm Corlin. Pleasure, mm, pleasure to meet you. Well, how about it? I so what's your fancy? Hmm. Okay. Uh, what do you have? That's. Rice, flour, hair, herb, yum, potato. 
fish. Carnivore food. Well, we do probably need more of this. Any problems? Let me know. Do for you. First thing I'm going to do when I get back to my own place is check my trees for new leaf growth. Let's see. Um, eight, no fence, small trough. There is a map. Okay. That doesn't mean that there's anything I need to meet here anymore. by the older engineers and from what I've heard it's well let's just say it's a bit of a fixer-upper. Now I don't mean to boast but fixer-upper is kind of my specialty around here. Let me walk you home and we'll see if there's any any basic maintenance I can help with. Sound good? I wasn't exactly gonna go straight home but okay. This old place sure brings back memories. I feel a little guilty letting it get into such a state. If only you could have seen what it was like back in the day. Still, then is then, now is now. Let's see how beautiful this place can be again. Well, if you're going to start somewhere, best to start small. Might I suggest we begin with Lucky's little patch of paradise. Let me take a closer look here. In the meantime, could you see if you can find some old fence posts lying around? did you need? <laughs> this should be enough. Step over here and see if you can take out one of those posts you found. Why don't we start over here? Stuck with this Boulder, at least for now, but we can work around it. Gorgeous. Now for the finishing touch. Every pen needs a gate. pin and a job well done. Would your lovely steed care to take it for a spin? If Lucky's happy, then I'd say we should be too. By the way, there's nothing that says this pen needs to stay right here. Feel free to, to up sticks and drop it down anywhere on the property. Easier to move the pen than the boulder. After all, if we could move the boulder, I'd be home by now. <laughs> well, I'd best be off and 
but give me a shout if you ever need a hand. Bye, Verla. Bye, Lucky. Three seasons instead of four. Hmm. Here for our food. Ooh. discovered. Hmm. Nice little place to sit. more herbivore food over there. I wonder if Lucky would like pears. Yeah. Oh, hello again. Welcome to my house. Please don't mind the mess. I wasn't expecting visitors today. What mess? Oh, you're too kind. So, how's the new house? Have you worked out a plan yet? Not really. What? No plan? Item number one is any in on any plan I make is make a plan. Sometimes I don't even make it past item one, but it'll still make for a great day. Thanks for stopping by. Maybe I'll uh, if you ever finish my to-do list. That is. in a moment. I've just about finished a huge entry regarding Wurrosaurus' diet. Don't write this down now. There we go. Thank you for waiting. I just couldn't risk losing my train of thought. While there's been so much, been much written on the subject of dinosaurs, it's very vital and vitally important that we record as much as we can. I'd love to read with work sometime. Oh, really? Mary and I would love to share our, all our findings in a book someday. Unfortunately, like most of my projects, I never quite know when to stop writing. Say, just thinking out loud here, but I believe the mystery of the parasaur might just be a brilliant climax. If reference books have cli had climaxes, that is. Well, I think they do. Oh, fear not. Lucky surely isn't the only parasaur out there. Er, even though... All evidence points to the contrary. Oh dear, never fear. I will. I have just the snack that will brighten her up. How about a mango? Don't think she tried a mango before. Beyond dinosaur diets, I'm afraid I'm all out of data. Perhaps Granny might offer up some more information. After all, she's lived here the longest. Like I said, just thinking out loud. You must be busy. I'll let you get on your way. <laughs> Okay, can't go into Owen's house. Can I go swimming? Nope. I don't know where.
I should have brought Lucky out. Hmm. Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. Berries. Nice. I do worry about what happens if I run out of stamina. Will I just have to slow walk everywhere or... Do I faint because my day is now over? Let's find out, shall we? making noises. Okay, I just can't run anymore. somewhere to go. Am I on my on the right path? Yes. I just can't run anymore. Hmm. Oh. Different way to get up there. Probably. Probably went the exact wrong way. Oh, it's Mary's house, okay. Assuming Mary might be off adventuring. Understandable. Have a merry day! Cranberry bushes? Yay! Cranberry Is an 
algebra. Hmm. Algebra calculable. Hello, guys. This is back to Pebble Plaza. There's obviously other people because, like, there's somebody I haven't met. Oh, he won't be. Yeah. Search the valley hidden pond. Hidden pond. Go back and see. If Lucky likes a mango. And also, if Lucky will pick me back out because running around is slow. And this is to sell things. Hey, Lucky. Just to get those in. Now let's see here. We've got a path over here to investigate. Maybe it's not here. It sure seems like it might be. But maybe they're talking about one in the woods? Hmm. Fairy circle. I'm riding lucky I can go super fast, but 
Let's not go super fast. Dash. down here. Hmm. So the statue records. I am loving this. It's absolutely adorable. There's so many cuties. Is this the pond? Looks like a secret pond. Could mm, could look. Hmm. I will say it's a little finicky when using my controller, but that could just be me. Hmm. Maybe it's not in season. Um, where's Lucky? Oh, there you are. I don't see... books or anything. I thought that might have been might have been the secret pond, but maybe it's not. Doesn't seem like it. that I was supposed to investigate. This is it. Oh no, it looks like the path I had was blocked. Must be the boulder that Granny and Marlo were talking about. Hmm. How am I supposed to do that? Maybe Lucky has the ability? Or Lucky will have the ability? 
If I train Lucky... Yeah, not sure where the secret pond is. Hmm. So let's get back home. is home, I'm just kind of wondering. Ah, over this way. Okay. Good night, Lucky. See if anything happens tomorrow. Maybe I'll be able to level up lucky enough. Oh, lucky, what you doing? Oh, what have you found, lucky? Looks like my old flute. I used to play this all the time for you, didn't I? Well, why not? Let's have a tootle, shall we? For old time's sake.
Do you think Lucky still got it? Hmm, maybe I never had it. I'll keep practicing. Mark my branches. Did you hear that noise just now, or am I going flappy? My flute? Oh, that was you? Well, keep practicing. You'll get there one day. Alrighty, Rue. I woke up. Itching like an... Itchosaur... Itch... Itch... Theosaur. Sorry, I know that one. And I still had trouble. To plant some seeds this morning. I also literally woke up itching. Mary's bed, spare bed gives me the scratches. But I'll have... It'll have to do until I get back home. Anyway, come on, come on. No time to dawdle. Alright, come on. Get your hoe out. That handy wee ho gets the soil ready for seed. Very important step. Go on, take a spray. Uh, I'm gonna do it up by my house. Or over here in front of Lucky's fencing. Like you've done this before. All right, time to plant the goods. Brought a few seeds just to get you started. Well, go on. I can smell those carrots already. Maybe I should stand back. <laughs> Whoa, 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 you're not done yet. You got the watering can Marla gave you? Go on, whip it out. Very nice, but you can't water without water. Can you? There's a pond over there. You should do the trick. Pond? Where? Pond? Where? Pond over where? Oh, over here. Time to get muddy. Look at you, you're practically a farmer now. Listen, a couple of top tips before I leave your, mm, you to your whatnots. Number one, don't forget the seeds, because nobody's going to buy a patch of wet dirt. And number two, water your crops every day. Well, you can skip the rainy ones, but you get what I mean. Finally, you might be surprised to discover what dinosaurs can do. I've lived here longer than anybody, and I've seen helpersauruses of all sizes, shapes and sizes. Why, I don't... Bet Lucky here's got some helpful skills. Look at those beautiful claws. I'll bet you're a digger, ain't you? Atta girl. Tell you what. As soon as those carrots have sprouted, come tell me and we'll celebrate you becoming a fully fledged farmer. Well, you picked that up speedier than a Styrocosaurus. I'm off to Pebble Plaza. Come say hello soon, kiddo. want to work lucky on stones. But first, I have to pull out my book and write about carrots. There we go. Lucky! Come on. Up. 
Get a little corn meal. You can use me to get past these. Looks like that's an, an expansion over there. There's an expansion over there. Look, he's too tired. Granny, yep. Um, we have boulders. We can go and meet. Oh, hmm. greetings, Viola. I was just taking Bongo on his daily constitutional. Mary was asking about you this morning. She sounded excited. No doubt, another crazy idea. You should talk to her. If you can find her. I have no idea which way she went. Let's go over to the plaza because that's one of the places I gotta go. Anyway... I don't think you met Pippin last time you were here. Pippin, this is Viola. Hello, I'm Pippin. Pippin makes poppins. Yes, I make poppins. Poppins are like little cakes. Oh, excuse me, they are not like little cakes, Marlo. Poppins are a cultural tradition from an age-old family recipe. Tell me something, Viola. How, how would you describe a cake? Exactly. See, Marlo? As per tradition, poppins are crunchy, dry, salty, cr chunky, taste absolutely nothing like cake. Thank you very much. My bad. It's been a whole- it's been a while since I had one. I'd forgotten their charm. Would you like one, Viola? They're really good. That's what everyone says. Ask Mary. She buys them every week. Yes, please. Enjoy. There's no crunch more satisfying than biting into a poppin. Fifty shells, please. Pippin, Viola is new to the neighborhood. Okay, 45 shells then. Really, Pippin? Be fine, guess you can just have the, that one. Anyway, that's a poppin. If you need any more, Pippin's got you covered. Except on baking days when my stall is closed. That's the day I make more. It was nice to meet you. Look like someone who needs a poppin. Uh, so you're here to take a notebook to Ab for Avery? Here it is. Thank you so much. Uh, my gosh, your poppins are expensive. Very freshly baked poppins. Expensive poppins! Super expensive poppins. Hey there, how can I help? Uh, between you and me, it's getting a bit rough when the path to Dapplewood blocked. I'm doing my best to keep up with the needs of the community, and it's tricky without my tools back home. My makeshift stone tools are really starting to wear out. Hey, with all the clearing you've been doing on your ranch, would you have about ten stones you could give me? Yeah? Oh, thanks so much. 
You tools would really help out around here. I really owe you one. Which reminds me. Take these. Good stock I can easily replenish thanks to your help. Boulder blocking dapple with a something else, isn't it? Shame all my tools are on the other side of the house. Ah well, there are worse places to be stranded, I guess. Custom lock. Oh. Interesting. Put the wrap to drag it in. Anything you need? How are you sleeping in your new ranch, kiddo? Gotta say, Mary could invest in some cozier bed sheets. I'm missing my home comforts. <laughs> the sooner the path of Dabblewood gets cleared, the better. You and Lucky seem to be the exploring type. You'd love Dabblewood. Any parasaurs out there? Look at the parasaurs, eh? Can't say I ever seen one myself, but my family had lived in the area for generations. Who knows? Might be something right lying around the house that could help your search. Can't know for sure until the path's cleared, though. Name survivor. Let's see, what kind of bring on here? Potatoes and carrots. I have a lot. Okay. Well, guys, it's actually been an hour that I've been playing this, but I can see how I could spend so much more time in this. And I probably will in my own time, but as for this video, I think that is going to be it. So thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell icon to keep up to date on all the videos. And remember to free the feral wildflower in you. Bye-bye!